And as long as <laughs> in the planet Earth, that's why Job nine twenty four says that the earth is given to the hands of the wicked, right? And he covered the face of the judges they are. If not, where and who is it? The Lord asked that question because it's plain to see who's ruling the planet Earth. All right, who's setting up? Who can sanction everybody, but nobody can sanction him? Yeah. All right. yeah. All right. Who can uh set up military bases on every different continent, but they ain't got a damn thing over here? They got nothing. <laughs> Unless he allowed, yeah, with the UN or some bullshit. Yeah, you know. They got to meet up there. You know. Uh -huh. Language. What language are we speaking right now? English. Yeah. Everybody got to put on a, a tie, a suit and tie. They, 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 at hey. the summits, man. <laughs> and share their face, man. That came from, uh, that came from uh, what's his name? Alexander the Great. Or, what is it? Alexander the Great Caesar. That was one of them that made everybody. He was always into shaving, man. Well, when you look at Caesar. Caesar. You look into the Israelites. I think when by the time it was one of those Jakes that got up in there, he he stopped all this. I think it was uh Severus stopped all that shit, man. That shit came from Esau. Shaving a man ain't supposed to shave, man. Huh. Right? The scripture tell you that a man having a beard, if you can grow a beard, it's a token of, of a badge of uh manly hey, dignity, man. Dignity, yeah, you gotta grow it. He's like in a while, you have a lion. A lion has a mane. A lioness don't have a mane, man. That's for a reason. That's to tell us the difference between the two. You no, know? it's about the it's about manly pride, man. Right. What's on YouTube as well? Yeah, they couldn't sound being a female treatment. Well, female sound bites. Damn, so yeah, something like that, like you know, shade, like this thing was not fine. Yeah, it's. Was he shamed because the honest power was like, like he was a special from birth when he was born? He was born with the strength of the Lord, so he had to uh take a basically take a Nazareth vow, which goes into where he had to keep his hair. All right, he had to grow and say he couldn't cut his hair long as he lived because that's where his strength came from. Not there's a, that ain't, that don't mean it's for everybody, but it again is it it is in the law to where we're not supposed to ball our heads, we're not supposed to cut our beards off. That's why you see Jake with five o'clock shadows, man. Or you'll see where his hair's supposed to grow, all right? But it ain't there, all right? So that's, that's all according to the law. Even lining, your hair lining the corners of your head, that's all. We as we as the children of Israel, we ain't supposed to do that. Yeah. That's, now, the way we keep our strength is following the laws of the commandments to the best of yeah. our I'm Coming back to our heritage, that's, that's where our strength lies as the so-called Black, Latino, Native American. These, especially in the end time, because it's going to happen over here Martial arts troops, FEMA camp, we're gonna get torching people and shit like that. I was straight gonna lie and knowing who the, who the Messiah is. Basically, his name is Yahweh. When they even call God, and when they call Jesus Christ, his name is Yahweh Shot, man. So, ain't no, ain't no such thing as Allah and, and Buddha and, and uh, what to call that shit. Jesus and stuff. That's it's all fairy tales, man. It's all lies. And that's why the Lord got the real men in the world on the block. Teaching the word in these end times because as you can see, America coming to an end. You know, these elite bankers, Rothschild, they on a they on a, a war path to kill as much as they as people as they can, man. They already started with the C nineteen. You know, you know what I'm talking about, right? Right, yeah. Yeah, you know we on YouTube. Yeah, we on YouTube, so we can't talk about one because they will flag our videos. But you know, you got you got to use lingo. But the C nineteen. They're hitting people at home to take you out, man. Ultimately, going to usher in the, the market. You know what the market of beats is, right? Come on, yeah, I know what the market of beats is. Yeah. Yeah. What is it, though? It's the market of beats. Like, you don't supposed to let them put it. You don't supposed to let them put it in. I don't know if it's a search part or whatever. Right here, it's like, it's like, it's like, it's control. Face like, well, you, gonna, you ain't going to better buy no food. But I, 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 so what they're doing now with the, with the C19 where you can't go into the stores, right? Like, you gotta, have, I mean, she got that vaccine. I just try to go to hell, really. Like I say, it's my first first time living in Texas. Yeah. My girl out here traveling, like, so I just saw, so what about, you know, well, I try to go to hell, really. They like, you ain't got the vaccine, man. You can't. It's like, I didn't even know that. Yeah, that's how, that's how it's gonna be with the, with the, with the, with the, with the uh, chip. You can't buy no chip. Yeah, can't buy no chip. Yeah, but the chip is a, it's a, it's a little chip but the size of a grain of rice that they're gonna to try to implant under the skin. Your right hand or your forehead. And they said Bill Gates was talking about that already. Bill Gates already yeah. talked about that. He's the main one trying to push you. He's the main one. I mean, hey, like he ain't been already up to the computers and all this. So he already took up with all that. I think we talking about it. Right. He basically took up with the computers and all that already. So boom, these 
they looking like, okay, well, he got all the money, well, he a man's fly, so we're going to do what he say. For first, shoot some of these people, don't control anybody, we're going to know they hit it all the time. What the guy did? I mean, Elon Musk, Elon mm-hmm. Musk is the he's the one that's going to be over, they'll take their city up your nostrils to put it in your forehead, put it, put the neural link, neural link, brain link, man. And what, what, man, hey, what, what part of Texas is from? I'm from Houston. Houston, yeah, we got brothers in Houston. Houston, I just, I mean, we are in living. Don't make a whole yeah, but like, I see how that I didn't see them home. They were about 19, came home, they didn't see them. Yeah, we got brothers. Yeah, I, you know. I mean, I'm born with y'all. I mean, see, I pray to this man. Yeah, I feel y'all coming from and I say, I pray to this man, and I ain't speak up. I don't know, I'm sorry, I'm like, you should fuck up all. He's like, I will, so I'm speaking up. I'm like, this. My point of view, don't just speak to nobody. I pray to this, I pray to speak to this man, and I pray to this man. I ain't, I'm type of like I ain't got I ain't got no problem really sitting there this I just I just when I was looking at it like I I got yeah I got down like I just look at it like so I, I feel like he said this like I'm gonna different but say this to you though you got you got part of the swamp and the shoes you were Praise the Islam, but what you gotta do, my, my, my biggest thing to you is go home to research and understand how uh, Islam, Dr. Islam, right? Right? Uh, I don't know. Who, 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 uh, he's basically saying Muhammad, but basically Muhammad, see, I like paying him. What is Muhammad? What is Muhammad? Well, I'm gonna ask you this who, who is Muhammad's wife? What's her name? He was rich. He, what was what was what nationality was? I don't know, but I know she had stuff. And she was like she was she was stuff by the Roman Catholic Church back then was so called Negro. They said uh she was already uh, you know uh, big uh the church contribute to the, the church she sent the church out. She set up two stuff in the church to go out and find handsome guy that can actually uh. Salesman, cares for the guy because back then it was the so called uh, picking up from all the rest was coming down. Up. They did not set up Islam as a tactic to the hopes of winning, winning back over, winning the land back over. They set up, they set up Muhammad as a, a forerunner. Islam was set up by to show you how this a part of the world can church. That's not in the in the not in the uh the Quran. They have a book of Miriam. Book of Miriam. So what Miriam is, right? Uh, Miriam, Miriam goes back to Mary. Why why does why does worship Mary? So we how I have some worship. I mean why did they have a book of Mary? Mary. And then I mean we worship though, we got a book of Esau and we don't worship Jesus. We don't wish Jesus that I spoke to Esau in there too, though. Yeah, but why they have the Book of America? I mean, what, what well, the, basically, I get what you're saying. Basically, you're trying to say basically that came from the Bible. Basically, came from the Roman Catholic uh, Church. Roman Catholic Church set up Islam. Right, which you try to say the same people that say Quran, the same people in the Bible. Sorry, but the Bible just a, what you about to say? The Bible just a, well, the Quran, because the word Quran just means to recite, right? The Quran ain't done more than a. Uh, uh, let me see. It's like a, not a carbon copy, but it's like a watered down copy. It just took scriptures and uh, they bastardized. They, they took scriptures from the from the Bible and and reworded it to the liking of they of uh, they uh of their culture. Now let me tell you this. Like he said, it comes out of the Roman Catholic Church, which they their biggest thing in the Roman Catholic Church, church is religion. Do you know what religion means? Basically, way of life, right? No, it's it means religious, which means to restrain the whole back. So, like he said, they gave them at that time Islam to what? Basically, what? Get the people off course. That's why you got different religions today, man. Yeah, to win over it. To, to win up. Yeah. Negroes came up with the whole religion of Islam in hopes of gaining the trust of the of the uh, the Arabs. Yeah. What they can because you you should know about the the Crusades, right? Crusades. The Crusades war. I don't know too much about it, but. I like, but look, I'm gonna speed you through it. After a story, after a period of time, it was 
Muhammad came actually nice. Would you would you worship Islam? Would yeah. You worship would you do it? Yeah. Certain Israelites back then, because guess who guess who taught uh, Muhammad? Israelites, man. Israelite. So these were Israelites. She was Israelite. Yeah, but he remember he he was a uh, uh, yeah. Come on, understand? Yeah. So uh, once he started gaining power and popularity, he came actually like the second time he came a little third. Third time he came with the sword and started killing Negroes, man. Yeah. Then he did he. Why you think you ever heard of the Morris? Yeah, Morris, the Morris, the Morris, the Morris, the Israelites, the Morris, the Israelites. They ain't nothing but uh, Islam, Islamic worshiping Israelites, man. That was that was it was put on them by the force of the sword, All right? Because they remember Negroes lived in North North Egypt, Morocco, in Morocco they went to the Berber Strait. Spain, in Spain, so called Negroes as the Moors ruled the whole known world of uh, Europe, man. You know, but you gotta do some more. I'm, I'm telling you, yeah. so do some I, I mean, but do some more. I, 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 I mean, that, that's all over here. Yeah, I'm, I'm like, type person I am. I can't just okay. This is my religion. If you're saying wrong, I'm gonna go listen and see what's. Please like, give, give me. Give me, so I, I give, me give me the um the scripture about the uh. The scripture is about the Berenians, man, in Acts. I, I, I plead with you, brother. Please go back and study. I'm going to say this. In these times, Islam is nothing more than a prison house doctor, man. It's a prison house religion for protection and different yeah. things in jail. Yeah. Man. I mean, how do we start to speak? I mean, what did it mean? And I'm like, what? What? what was it? It's not. Yeah. What, what more does it mean? Right, man. Like, what the word it's, mean? It's, it's, what else I'm like, peace. Right? Yeah. Yeah, bring it up. All right, is that 17 and 10? The more actually And the brethren immediately sent. The Bereans. The Bereans. The Bereans. Yeah, bring it up. This is Acts 17. I'll start at 10. And the brethren immediately sent away Paul and Silas by night unto Berea. Who coming thither went into the synagogue of the Jews. These were more noble than those in Thessalonica, and that they received the word with all readiness of mind and searched the scriptures daily whether those things were so. They said they said they searched the scriptures daily to see if those things were true. That's what we asking you. Go back home and search what we're saying. If you want what you're gonna find out, it's, it's gonna be true, man. You know. We like I said, we had brothers in your in your place that was you know, in Islam and different things like that, and they came out of that, man. It's like dudes in the church. Because one thing about a one thing about a real man, but a only church is the truth. Yeah, why I, I when I joined Islam at first, I was like, "How you?" I'm, I got a question for you. Go ahead, finish. When you join Islam, it was it really was a whole bunch of stuff. Cause you know I'm a blood, so yeah. Man, I was still young. I went down on that, but it was just like. But I, what made me really get into it, I, I found peace. I don't, I don't know, you know, like certain people, like when you really feeling something, you you do something, like I found peace. I ain't gonna lie. I, found, I was at peace every time I was at Juma. If I wanted Juma, I like, it was like I was finding peace. Like, I'm not gonna even lie to you. I was finding peace from it. I ain't. Because we spiritual people. And really, bro, you're an Israelite, all right? We're gonna tell you that and we want you to go back and look that up and see that. Because, further of all, you join something. When you something, you can't join. You can't become something and then say this my heritage or my nationality. You can't join something. That's like today if I go join a club or something like that, I can't say this where I originated from or came from. You got to think about what you're saying. You join Muslims or uh, Islam and where you found peace. But Israelites are spiritual people. We looking for peace. We come from we are plain people. Jacob, which is our forefather, he was a plain man. All right, meaning what he was. Uh, you, you, you can. As an Israelite, he's you already you already an Israelite by blood, flesh, by the promises of the most promises and the covenant of the most high. Right. You can't become with something that you already you can't change. You can't become something that you already have. <laughs> yeah. Basically, yeah. so basically saying basically about took Shahada. It was like I, I basically became Muslim demon. You can't, but we let me tell you, you think about that. You wasn't a Muslim when you went to jail, brother. All right. Even being a blood, oh, you know, which we you know, we got, we got, yeah, brothers come from, 
these things that we thought what we thought we was until the the, the knowledge got from the scriptures basically uh saw that our spirit get that way and say our spirit try the spirits by the spirit because our spirits is of, of of the book of the scriptures man all right and that's why we understood from there is our heritage all right where we come from our nationality our whole line starting from adam man that's how we thought that's what we know yeah but you're a muslim so you're african uh, Af you're gonna say you're african-american Right. Come, you see, you said that you're black. Black is just this is black. This is black. Can't nobody this color, no. So I said that I ain't saying you go to Africa everything, you have people that say that, oh, how can you be from Africa and America? That's two different countries, man. I get what you're saying. But when you see any other nation of people out here, where they're from, they know exactly. They can pinpoint. I'm from this part of Germany. I'm from this part of so and so and so and so. Hey, they can it, 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 I used to. I ain't gonna say I used to get into with every like. I used to talk to them the American CEOs down there. You know how TV is. Uh, yeah, I, I don't I, I, know if it's in the prisons out here, but you know down there they gonna have a whole bunch of yeah. it's like seven percent of gonna be Africans. It's different now. Oh, but like I've traveled with some Arabs sometimes. They're like, we don't understand. You don't even know what you mean. You're not even real African. You can't say this. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a problem. I'm like, that's right. Give me Psalm 83. Could you, could you speak the truth? Because yeah. the thing about it, these, these, hey man, just like in that brother, that store brother right there. We've been dealing with them for over what, 10, 11 years. We go in there and talk to them. They know that you're not. They know that you're not uh, Arab. They know that you're not. That's, 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 yeah. They know this. The nations, the, the different nations of the earth, they know who we are. It's in, it's been in, it's, it's scripture. They've been knowing who we are. They just hide our nationality from us. That's who we are. They told you, oh, you every ten, you know, with us, with us, every ten years, our nationality change. You go from black, African American, Negro, colored. Every ten years, it changed. Oh. It's BIPOC now, Black Indigenous People of Color. <laughs> keep it real fast. Right, Psalm 83. Right. One, keep not thy silence, O Yahweh. Hold not thy peace, and be not still, O Yahweh. For lo, thy enemies make a tumult. See, our enemies, our enemies make a ruckus about us, go ahead. And they that hate thee have lifted up the head. These Arabs, these so-called Chinese, Japanese, the so-called white men. They have uh, lifted up the head with pride against us, man. Go ahead. They have taken crafty counsel against that people. They have taken crafty counsel against us, man. Right. And since, since the times of Christopher Cuba or Christopher Columbus coming over here, all right, going back to Adam Wise House, these guys have, even the, the top bankers have took, because you understand, when you understand that the Lords of London funded the whole the whole slave trade, all right, when you start understanding who, who uh, set up the bankers to take us down in Africa? And we're not from Africa. Negroes in America are not from Africa. We're from Israel, the land of Israel, right? And they funded all, they funded all that slave trade to actually bring them down as a people, man, to, to basically erase our heritage from them. And they, and they did it. They, they accomplished that, right? And consulted against our hidden ones, right? And they have said, come and let us cut them off from being a nation. Mm. Let us cut them off. From being a nation, that's why they they give us they fund us Islam, they fund us they fund us games, All right? They give you that. Those games were set up by the CIA, man. Going back way a little bit before the time of Tupi Will, I forgot one of the guys' names. The guy was a CIA. They, no matter of fact, CIA said we were also true. Exactly. They sent them over to dope because America. They, it was a war. This is a dude from a whole other country. The country, they, they was gonna have a war. He talking about uh the Panama, the, the country, the Pan, the Pan, okay, Pan so like that. And they communists of the Saint Anisus. Yeah, yeah, the whole, that whole the dude that was selling out, that was getting the dope to regrows, real regrows. Basically, he was under the CIA. The CIA was using him to send them up. And basically, the U.S. government was selling guns. In South Central and South America to the Contras and the Saint Denis, and they were sending the drugs back, and then the yeah, government was putting the drugs into the neighborhood. Yeah. Selling the dope, need the guns for all that shit set up, man. The games going back to Tukey Williams, all them guys were set up. All right, 
it started it started off as a community thing, then it turned into then it, you know, you know what? You can look this up too, my man. You know what? I'm talking about the California blood. You know that shit was you know what the first gang war in California was fought over? You say the first gang war? Between no the, the gang war of California or the blood and Crick Noodle who was fought over? Jay. Stolen bike. That was a Jay. It was a stolen bike. It's even worse. A jacket on a stolen bike. A jacket even worse. <laughs> the, jacket the, bike. the jacket was on a stolen bike. <laughs> <laughs> some of them, some of them don't even get killed and make it and make the guy go away and seem like they killed them and they start they start wars like that, man. It's all about dividing country, controlling both sides. Then they set up the, the Mexican game and now like I said, I lived in Houston. I know about, I know about uh, the uh, MS-13, Houston Blast and all them. Yeah. Catch yeah. the middle lights. They got them one too. You know. Hey, Doc. Yeah. Let me get it. You know, it went. <laughs> Go ahead, uh. That the name of Israel may be no more in remembrance. Yeah, that our names be no more in remembrance. Go ahead. For they have consulted together with one consent. These nations have consulted together with one consent. What? They are confederate against thee. They're confederate against us. That's why we always bring out when you go in, when you go into the, the UN or United Nations meeting, why is it there are no nations to represent the so-called Negroes today? There's no nation to represent the Native Americans. There's no nation to represent, and, and Chavez is dead now, so there ain't no nation to represent the Latinos. You don't have a seat up there saying Negroes. You got you got Chinese, Japanese, you got Russian, you got all these nations in there talking, navigating them themselves. But there's no one to speak up for them. And let's not even get into these fake ass leaders out here. Uh, the, the, uh, Malcolm Mexes and all them guys of the world. Them guys, a lot of them guys with agents and set up too. You know, they only been known as playing a big trick on us, bro. Even from the uh, NC, what it is? What's the color shit? NAC. Yeah. That shit was set up. That shit was set up in eighteen or eight by by so called Jewish people. Yeah, I, I, I've been thinking that too, though, man. I think I've been thinking. Yeah, it's just set up by Jewish people. I feel like they ain't gonna let no black, no, I don't, not black to say black, but I don't think like, you say Israel. Like, I don't think they gonna let like no Israel like you like. No power like that. <laughs> and, and you ain't get up there. Black Panthers, all that shit. They're like infantry. ACP. Black Panthers. It's all it's all Asian, man. We got we got one of them. Get that get Mason's all around the bears or so. Why them Mason's and part of the Blue Lake, man? You ever heard of J. Edgar Hoover? J. Edgar. He's the head of the FBI. He said there will never be another black messiah unless we set him up. Okay. Yeah, you know, kidding. and they said the most, and he also said the most dangerous thing to, to American whites of America is, is black unity. Okay? That's why you get your fair cars. These are all set up people, man. All your leaders, all the leaders, all the leaders of our people cause us to L. Let me say this. Yeah. Out of all them cats, man, that guy Milton Mix was probably the best one. <laughs> but he was, he was, he was, he was set up. Was, uh, Best of the world. <laughs> but he was set up with me. He tried to save the problem back when this came back. Like, you ain't no problem. Yeah, I've been against these white people. Man. Well, the guy, one of our elders, Alvin Bivens, right? He, he he actually he actually ran it with, uh he actually ran it with Malcolm X. He told Malcolm X, just like we're telling you the truth of who he is and everything. Malcolm X started to believe. He went told, he actually went told, uh, What's the name? Uh, Martin Luther King, man. Martin Luther King made that speech about he was set up. What he was set up? That guy, that guy, even in the FBI files of J. J. Hoover, that guy said he said that uh, uh, Malcolm X is a monk compared to uh, Martin Luther King. You know, you really ready for this? Monk, a monk. A monk. I mean, that guy wasn't doing absolutely nothing. Fireball compared to uh, Martin Luther King. That nigga was a homosexual, man. <laughs> Constitution is Constitution. Yeah. That's facts. All the friend was Bernard Rustin, man. You know, and I, like I say, even you see how when I leave the papers at the house, you're good. Hey, you know, I got. They say this for who? Martin Luther King. Yeah. yeah. I mean, 
His boyfriend name. I get it. I mean, I ain't never heard that about Martin Luther King. I didn't hear. I mean, I read something like that about Malcolm X. When he comes, I mean, I, I still can believe. That. I feel like they put that in the book though. No, nah, that's why. That's fantastic. That's actually what else he is. Tell me, I was giving him money. Dude, dude. Hey, hey, one of them. One of them. One of the. Uh, that was my first time in there. Yeah, he was saying. See, he told uh. Uh, what do you mean, man? Uh, in Philadelphia. Now he said, "Bring that big old, bring that big old ride over here." Hey, <laughs> hey the FBI, look the up. FBI got those like the tapes. wild those tapes sealed, and they like you said, man. He, uh, what her name is? His wife. That's like she had a she had, she had, she had this, it was sealed for ten years. It came off release. Uh, even uh Trump Trump released a lot of the shit, man. That dude, that dude was a was set up, and he was set up. He was set up by the white people to control us, man. He put us back to slavery. He said, "Keep us in slavery." I think I did my. He think I. He said, "I think I." I think I took my top on the house. But he was dealing with the Rothschilds. Yeah, yeah. They are. Yes, yeah, right. They like the Rockets. We're to run America. They, they, they own the, yeah, they own the America lock, stock, and barrel, man. Them the ones that say, hey, I want, I want two planes to hit those and they're going to happen. For real. Brother, you not no Muslim, bro. You joined that. Now, it's your, it's your responsibility, all right, to understand your heritage and your nationality, bro, because you can't become something and then say, that's what I am. You can't do that. Be you cool. must, what you, before you was a Muslim, all right, I joined it. What was you? I ain't gonna say blood. I ain't gonna say blood. There you go. So, but now who are you? But now who are you? You gotta find out who you are. That's that's the search, bro. At the end of the day, which again, we know who you are. You're Israelite. All right. From you, you, you come from the, the, the seed of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, man, which is God's chosen people on the planet Earth, man. And that's facts. Most important well, thing now as a man. It's basically finding out what, what, what defines you, what you willing to die for. What you who are you, man? Especially here in America, you've been lied to you? everything that you see is nothing more than a uh, uh you go ahead. I ask you this question. It's all on me. It's all on me. He said it. He said it. I said it. He said it. I 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 said it. If that would mean God, it mean like he is one, like you you pray a lot five times a day. I pray a lot you know. I see that's the thing. I was studying, man, studying, studying, like reading the books to read. Like I ain't got a lot to read. If something else, I want to know. Yeah, the word Allah is a Hebrew word. It means power of God. Now, our God has a name, Yahweh. Right? Allah is just a nameless, this is an idol. Because it, it was a prophecy that we would go into slavery on ships and serve gods of wood and stone. You serving the God of stone. You go to uh, Mecca. In Mecca. They're the stone and they kiss the stone. They kiss the stone. <laughs> worshiping the stone. That's what, that's what Allah is. You know what the cop is? That silver copper stone, you know what that is? Well, it's going back. We, we all going. We all going back know. to Rome. I don't know what it is. It's been a while. Ready? I don't know exactly, exactly. But somebody give me a picture of it, please. Around like a certain number of times. I'll give it to you. It's only I'm, what I'm about to give you. It's only it's only for you to digest, bro. It's only for you to digest this now. Now that copper stone that you see, if they worship, they walk around all day. It's actually, it's a it's an actual it's a felt symbol. It's a vagina. You know the niggas they kiss it. They, they hit it. <laughs> yeah, you know what I'm saying. They throw little white stones at it. Semen. Uh, oh, no, white stones at it all day. What, 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 what does that look like? What does that look like? Uh, you you got to know what you're shipping, bro. I ain't cut off. I believe in that. White stones are semen. Semen. Can't do that. Yeah, that's facts. That's facts, bro. That's facts. And you know how in uh Islam they say Allah's got like 
999 different names that goes back to arab paganism because they had 99 gods and when when khadijah got muhammad to create islam he incorporated arab paganism with as a, as the brothers were saying earlier taking things out of the scriptures but twisting it to make it all fit together to make it more easily sellable to the arabs I say this real quick the catholic church did the same thing with christianity they did all the roman gods and they tried to mix it with the bible the arabs did the same thing with their gods and tried to mix it with the Quran. it's all the same it's all religion that's it paganism hey, hey when we have it's the first to serve they give you those gods so you can't serve your true god that's, that's it, it. They, that's, that's it. They all gave all of us different goals and basically made us want each other to take it. Yeah, that's it. The ha yeah, that's it. That's what I'm saying. The handsome youth. Tell that we know what we're talking about. We didn't deal with the, you know, I didn't read the Quran. You know, it's nothing, but I will say this. You got to understand what you're dealing with. Because even in the Quran, they say, when you die and go to heaven, you're going to be vast. A bunch of handsome youths. Oh, boy, is handsome. It's not talking about women. They're talking about boys. And they got a, a, a practice over in Afghanistan and like Pakistan and all that called bacha bazi, which means boy play, where they get underage boys and get them to belly dance and, and handle business with them. That's those handsome youths. But it's it's called bacha bazi, and it means boy play. Simply, man. That's those handsome youths. You know what the priest doing, man? Don't tap that. Don't tap that around that, bro. That's what's going on, bro. That's what the Roman Catholic Church that they do. They 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 plug them little boys up because they, the Roman Catholic Church they say that the closest the closest thing to purity is the anus of a little boy. Yeah, but and we get. You read, you get into that shit. That's what they. That's what it is. Well, they, 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 uh, they push pedophilia, pedo, pedophilia, pedophile, pedophilia. pedophilia. They push that because they got a new saying with the pedophilia. Not saying that they just misunderstood. Uh. It, man, that's it. That's a man, but less than a child. There's mm -hmm. nothing right about that. You can't justify that in no kind of way, man. All right, sure. pedophilia pedophilia is for devils all right and the devils that is for the lord gonna kill every last one of them man isn't that all a bunch of them just passed yeah the lord gonna they with pedophilia they ain't against it so what you permit you promote so if you're a muslim and the things we telling you go look them up and see if they true if you permit that you promote it mean you with it we know we, hmm. we, we know you ain't with it though. <laughs> yeah, you get what i'm saying <laughs> Hey, you got to say, look, yeah, I believe in that too. That's your, it's your customer, bro. You, 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 you know, I mean, yeah. to... man, now I ain't gonna just sit there and tell no anything. I'm gonna sit there. Part of I study. I ain't, I ain't sitting on what, like, I'm gonna study and, and read and read. Yeah, go, go look. Especially with, with, with our religion, like, I used to get into it with them and, uh, yeah, yeah. I ain't gonna do you, man. I wasn't going up the wheel, but I'm like, all right, I mean, if you gonna tell me this, I'm gonna make you work for it. Yeah. That means I don't know what you're going to do before you do it. So I'm, I'm just, I don't take this no disrespect. At first, at one point in time, I'm like, man, I ain't believe it, though. Right. A lot of us really didn't. But a lot of us didn't to a degree. That's what America does you. America beat you down so much. Well, you don't, you like, you know what? Fuck everything. Fuck like everything. Yeah, you get the point. Get this bad. Get to the point where I'm like, man, we know if it's real. How we know if it's real? I don't, don't get mad at us for believing what we believe. The spirit, though. Gonna reveal particular things to you that's gonna know a visible truth, man. All right, the spirit of the Lord. You and again, a lot of things is to come with faith. Faith gotta be wrapped around it because at the end of the day, you gotta believe in what you believe. All right, like you gotta be fully set on your on your on your methods of believing, bro. Like if you believe you're a Muslim 100 percent it could back it up, you go find out that you know the information you gotta find and stand on that business. But again, you not you not Muslim, all right? You're an Israelite. You're searching right now. Searching, which we all had a spirit of searching at a point, man. You say this, the most I got you here today, man. For real. Plan on doing the Lord. Anyway. You was out here and you heard the words that you heard, man. That's it. And then I got the brother the script, the scripture to back it up too. Go ahead, bring it up. It's Job 15. And a dream and a vision at the night when deep sleep falls upon men. And slumberings upon the bed. Then he opened the ears of men 
and seal up their instruction. That's how the most high gets men or people to do what he wants them to do. When they when you fall asleep, the Lord programming your event, the things you're gonna do the next day. You know, whether whether that whether that for your good or for, for bad, whether something, you know, every like really and truly, every day in itself is like a spirit. So the Lord is programming the events. You know, you ever watched uh butterfly effect? Like as, as Christian, you see how because he he stepping out in the street, he did step in, step in the street. Something could have happened. A chain reaction of things could have happened. Or a chain reaction thing veered them off from doing one thing. Same thing with you. Like the Lord programmed it last night for you to to run into us, man. To hear the things that you hear. All this is what happening right now is spiritual, man. If I can say something to you, in order for you to be a Muslim anyway, you got to know this first. Wow, well, okay. know this first. So it's gonna need no partner. Right, and then and you know, like I say, the greatest thing that you can do now get into the get into the Bible, man. Understanding Bible. Why 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 does every time you see this guy Louis Farrakhan, this guy's quoting the scripture? I thought he was about the Quran though. <laughs> so yeah. guy always quoting the Bible. He's contradicting He offers contradicting himself. Who we our nationality is and one time this guy said we was Esau. Now he's saying we Israel. <laughs> This is, the, this is the top. Uh, this is the top. What, what was the word? He got is uh, this is the top Muslim. This is yeah, yeah. The yeah. Muslim of all Muslims in the world right now. Louis Farrakhan. This guy is saying we Israel now, man. Contradict itself on every every level, man. When you listen to him, like, yeah, they talk the contradiction. <laughs> they watch us, man. Mm -hmm. Really, they learn it from me. So. He's different. Uh, uh, T.D. Jakes on it. Them cats watch us, man. They know that the Lord, the Lord dealing with the prophets in these last days. These young, these young, mid-aged men, older men. It's only how is and by way teaching. Because we all, we ain't just in, we ain't just in, we ain't just in, uh, in, in, in New Orleans, man. We ain't in every 50 states. We in other countries. We got brothers in Japan, Africa, South Africa, Germany, Holland, Germany, Holland, London, you, you, man. That's for a reason. For these last days, you know. Like I say, any 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 real man, and like I say, any real man, like I say, brother, I, I can I can tell that you are you are, you're a thinker. So with that being said, you gotta you gotta go study, bro. Go study. Go find the origin of the thing. The thing that you say that you is, you gotta go find the origin to any any and everything. You know. I have a lot of time. You gotta and Farrakhan knew who he is, bro. He just set up not to tell us, man. He, you know, but he can't. He gotta. It gotta be. You know. It gotta be. Yeah. He gotta. He he can only go so far, man. But he know. He know he lives for life, man. Yeah. If he won't live, he saw what happened to Mal. Well, he he became the head of the nation of Islam for for assassinating Mal. It's something to do with assassinating. Abu Bibbins told him what was up. Abu Bibbins. Abu Bibbins is our our elder. You know, he passed away because a bunch of Muslims beat him up back in, uh, I think, Harlem or whatever. But he told Malcolm X the truth, though. He told Malcolm X what the deal was, man. And Malcolm X, huh? What are you talking about? Like, basically, like, what you, what you, what we like, what you, we telling you. <laughs> and, and Malcolm X went told uh, uh, Mother Luther King, man. That's why he, he did the shit he did. That's why he took them guys out, man. So he had to kill them. He had to rush you. Once hey. you hire Farrakhan, come clean and start telling me they're writing all the truth, they're gonna kill him, man. Mm -hmm. I, I showed y'all the way I showed y'all the video where Ruff Abinagan said, Oh, I move out the way for the sniper to have a clear shot. Yeah, yeah. I knew they was even this getting this. Jackson 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 was paying a million dollars back then mm -hmm. to wear Malcolm X and he said, shoot the one that don't have a tie on. All the ones had turtlenecks on that day. All the ones had was suit tie on Malcolm X or uh, Mother yeah. King. Yeah. Yeah. Brains up. Who killed? Who killed? Uh, Malcolm X. His own. His own. His own. Okay, man. It's wrong. That's yeah. He's gonna be smiling. Yeah, bullshit. Trying to make it but he was just he gonna keep all wrong with it. Like, yeah, he cheated. So yeah, bullshit. Yeah. Because see, remember when um, what's the guy name? The guy was over there back then. The older man. In my what happened? What happened when these guys started getting international? You remember? Remember, uh, Malcolm X speaking on international. Uh, it was an in, uh, international event back then. He spoke on it. He called a white man. A, he called a 
He called uh, the white people something on the news, man. They got pissed off with him. I forgot what happened. Don't tip my tongue. Well, <laughs> 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 you know, it's my I read, I read the news from back. I'm trying to bang. Yeah, he got on the he got on the news and he called. It was an interview he did. He, you know, he talked. You know, he said something that uh, Elijah Muhammad got real pissed off with him and shit, though. You know? But like I said, that that dude was that dude was my brother or some shit like that. I didn't say it like that. It was something. It was something controversial that he said. He got suspended and shit for a while. Yeah, right when right right when he came back, that's when everything started happening. Right, right when he came back, so when he got suspended, he was he was chilling. He messed up. He was chilling. They told him he couldn't speak when he go. And they tried to assassinate that guy plenty of times. Yeah, they told him he couldn't do no more. Uh, couldn't do no more time. So they, uh, right. Yeah, all them guys. All them guys were no more than agents, man. Them guys were set up by the government, even. But the king went to uh, seminary school to learn the civil rights movement. You got to go watch the movie The Butler to show you that. The movie The Butler to show you how they were set up, go to school and, and get taught how to be. That's why the niggas went, in, went into the, the bodegas and the, and the restaurants with whites and got beat the shit out of Got dogs bit on them and sprayed with water. That shit was all set up, bro. No? It was all, it was all set up, man. All of them. Most of these, most of these so-called black leaders are masons. They're paid off by the following security charters, all right. And they're they're told what to do, man. The so-called white man has a receipt for them niggas, man. And why they never these, these church pastors? They never tell you to tell you what we talk, man. Never. They never tell you that, man. Because it, it's gonna fuck up their money. No. Follow us see three. Yeah, and all of them, all of them, uh, from E.D. Du Bois, Frederick Douglass, uh. What's this guy name? Henry McKinney. That's the guy that set up. That's the guy that set up uh, the boule. All them cats are sold out, man. Most of these, most of these guys you see on TV. Anybody, anytime you see somebody on the TV on the medium, they're so they really kind of sold out, man. They're talking heads. They're told. They're told what to do. You know. All right. So you should like corner. He sold out too. Exactly. I think, I think he sold out. Big, I think he sold out. Big horn frog head nigga sold out, man. So I, that nigga sold out. I lived in Houston for eleven years. I know who Cornell X is. I think he sold that too. Yes, indeed, Lord. He get niggas to turn himself in. They go do a shooting or killing. I make scene once. Oh, she sold out. Oh no. I'm trying to say I don't see how she lived that long. Like Maxine Waters or uh uh she wanna get Sheila Jackson. Sheila Jackson Lee, all the fuck them sold out. I'm sold out, man. That's why that's why they go out there. Watch it, watch it. Give me the one that uh with the one in the Amos the teacher with the hand. Proverbs. Proverbs six, round eleven or something like that. Yeah, that's why they that's why they put their hands in the best of Pisces. You ever seen them put their hands hands like this? All they all they had for the team. It's like two ball things they do. Yeah, when you you see a nigga put his hand right here or hand on the chest all right. So they do like this, they get his on time. That's it. Yeah. That's a steeple hand. That means keep sending me my money. Right. Keep buying. It's uh, Proverbs 6, verse uh, 13. He that wake up with his eyes and speak up with his feet and teach it with his fingers, for forwardness is in his heart. He devises a mischief continually. He saw discord. So they teach you with their feet. They they stand like this perfectly on the square. They teach you with their hands. They they do they do shit like this and let you know I'm a, I'm another I'm another fucker, man. I'm another this travel man. man. Yeah, we know about shit, bro. Yeah. Shit, bro. You know we know about all that shit, man. We know about all these all these cats is sold the goddamn out, man. So you think they had some to say we didn't kill? Oh yeah, probably so. All right, you think he was to sell that too? Oh, they, oh, they, oh. See, he, what he, what he was doing, fucking up. He was fucking up the FDA money with. He's fucking up that money, by uh, alkalinity, like hearing people for us. And that nigga was high as a motherfucker too. I ain't going. Yeah, that nigga was high as a motherfucker, man. Yeah, so when it comes to healing people and using the word that that C word, because you know the, the FDA has a seven billion dollar patent on that word. The word here. And he was doing that, they had to take him out. All these cats. A dude they had a dude back in 1996 by the name of Don Gray. He uh he cured HIV. 
And guess what happened? In the parking garage, they put they put a, they put two holes in his head, man. Because at, if, at the end of the day, when you go to CBS, you go to Walgreens and Ballas, Tarnall, and Advil, you putting Ferraris in different how you getting these guys' houses built. They want to keep you sick, patch up the bullshit, man. They're not trying to, they're not trying to fix the goddamn thing. You see what time it is? You got a couple more, you got a couple more, bro. Whatever you want to do, all right? Yeah, because we just, we're going to never stop. Right? <laughs> like, man, you know? All right. We gotta we gotta go to camp, brother. But we gonna give you a card yeah, and you everything. Can, you know, unless you wanna come again. Yeah, that's it. Hey, you know, if you ain't got nothing to do, we about to go down now on Bourbon and Canal. And that's yeah, where yeah, we teach. Yeah. That's what we teach. It's just this, this was a pre-camp lesson. Like this, what we do. We go there. You know what I'm saying? Give, you, uh, give him the card. Oh, well, give him the give him the Wait, card. Too, yeah, no. no, give him the card and I can. You know what? You know what? Level twenty one downtown Houston on, on Main at. Someone downtown, Main Street. Yeah, Main, like Main. Street, but I don't know. Like Main and McKinney. Well, not Main and McKinney. I gotta come back. Main and Will. Main and. Ah, oh, I got the brothers going. You got Main. You got Main. You got Main. You got Main and McKinney. You come back to where twenty one at? What's the million was that? Ah, I don't be downtown. Like that. I don't be downtown like that, man. That's what I never know. Like. I ain't. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, 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 I don't that, I'm not go down time like that. This was club, so I don't even be doing none of that, baby. Like I don't do that. Okay. Thing, I, don't. I can give you once I once I get off the phone, I get the information for the first one. Right, that's cool, man. Um, whatever you want to do. Yeah, nah. It was that was eventful, man. You know, the law had to go the way that it went through the spirit. You know, and we and we of course we obey the spirit, man. You know, we don't try to uh, obey our own thirst. And not like that. We follow through the spirit of Yahweh while Yahweh shot, man. Which we're led of. And we believe and trust that, man. You know, we don't we don't put emphasis on ourselves. Like we don't get no glorification for which we teaching you. We just we out here to tell every man the right way, man. Now, if he choose to take whatever route he wants, then it's consequences for what you, <laughs> you know, whatever route you want to take. But we gonna say this, bro. You're an Israelite, bro. You right. the word, Yash man. Allah. Everybody get marked, man. Yeah, you getting you mock none. So you might want, like you say, you find out the truth. And really, the Lord allow you to find out the truth. Contrary, probably we might don't look like it, but this is the truth right here. <laughs> this is the truth in, in which at least you know to who you are in the congregation, the tabernacle of the Lord, bro. Like this is the truth. I know someone look like, oh, they ain't in a church or they ain't that, you know, like nah, the Lord ain't dealing that week when you read the scripture. Right? The Lord, the Lord said so you're gonna find. You're gonna find wisdom on the chief place on the, in the concourse, right? Yep. In the gate. You know, the scripture says you, your eyes should see your teachers, right? And it, and we, guess what? If we was in the casino building, we was in the, if we was in that building right there, you walk past, you wanna know. Yeah, never heard of Sardis. Yeah. No? Yeah, but that's what it is, bro. You know, we don't go get the cap, you know, but they, you know, through the spirit, the Lord, you know, the Lord have it to what we're going right now. Yeah. Now we about to walk straight down. You, you follow us if you want or whatever. Yeah. Yeah, what you got? Isaiah 26 and 4 and 5. Uh, Trust in you, the Lord, forever. For the Lord, Yahweh, is an everlasting strength. For he bringeth down them that dwelleth on high, the lofty city, he layeth it low, and he layeth it low, even into the ground. He bringeth it even into the dust. Right. Like the Lord is the like, he, the Lord is faith in Yahweh, and his son named Yahweh Shah, as long as we have faith in that name. It, we can go and deliver us what, once the destruction comes to this whole this whole place out here. You know what I'm saying? With, with our, all, all that fire and all that stuff, you know, because we're, we're teaching early. You understand? Yeah, you might want, you might just want to come to camp. You're going to have another air full of, 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 of things to come, man. Because, like I said, what's going to happen here in America, all right, with, with this market of beast, FEMA camps, they're going to put they're going to put trained armed killers on these streets and, and putting so-called Americans in concentration camps. That's crazy, because my father showed me a video earlier about uh, Biden was talking about another 200. I don't know if it's me or me. I was like, you know, I was like, basically put more firepower on, on the opposite space. Like, yeah. Instead of walking around just yeah, you, with some mistakes type stuff. Well, they already did, you know. If you if you see the, if you see the, the y'all brothers, remember the police in Ferguson? When, when Michael Brown died, when Michael Brown died, how they look? Look like the military. Yeah, they did. 
up the big foot. Level four vests on. AR 15s and shit now. Helmets, military helmets now. That's for a reason. Yeah, that's what they're doing now, man. They ran the Yeah, go ahead, huh? Right? Better wear another wear another. Where you yeah, where you gonna never stop by? Right? But you know, you know, law willing, hey, you know, brothers behind it, you know, camera, you know, time and board of different things and through the spirit, the law had things go the way it went, you know, edification of the, you know, the body, man, the camera, man on no man in the same, you know, position or whatever whoever in. But ultimately the Lord, the Lord is the one with the spirit, man, you know. But we're gonna go ahead and get the camp, man. So Lord willing, that was edifying. We won't give infinite honors and prayers to y'all. was shot by Shimmer Cocker Dash. To the elders and apostles of Great Millstone and salutations to the argument that's pushing the truth and sincerity. To the next time, we'll say Shalom. Shalom.